to my channel. Today I was cleaning out my cosplay closet and was like a little overwhelmed with the amount of wigs that I have. I didn't start acquiring wigs until about two years ago, I would say. I started cosplaying around two years ago as well and really getting into it for myself outside of the show Nostalgia Critic. That's when I really just went wig crazy. It's my middle name, Tamara Wig Crazy Chambers. She's nuts. Why? Okay, let's do it. When will my reflection show who I am inside? Oh, right now. I got this at a thrift store for 90 cents. And I would say it reflects that. I bought this because one, it was 90 cents, and I can't say no to something that's 90 cents. It's less than a dollar. I also thought it would be fun to do a gender bent Napoleon Dynamite with, with like the Where's Pedro, or pff, Where's Pedro, Where's Waldo, what? Vote for Pedro shirt. There's just something about white froze that no one should enjoy. I wore this in my Muppet Christmas Carols review as Michael Caine, because when you see this wig, it just screams, Michael Caine! This was also 90 cents at the thrift store. I think there's a lot of uses for this. Anytime I play a mom or someone who needs to speak to a manager. I'm pretty sure this was like $11 on Wish. I used it in a Carrie cosplay video for my Patreon where I covered it in red blood. I also painted the tips with eyeshadow for a Harley Quinn, very light cosplay that I did in the Tamers Ever Seen episode. It's that trash wig that you just kind of throw on and do whatever you want to it because you're not afraid of ruining it, but it has yet to be ruined. <laughs> oh my God. This was free off of Wish, so like two or three dollars for shipping. I bought it because it was cheap and I was gonna use it in a video. I kept it because if I get rid of it and I have to play, if I was like a heavy rocker who's addicted to drugs and also Link. I bought this wig on Amazon last year so that I could be a Breath of the Wild Link. Then my brother used it the day after. I really need to go through to my cheaper wigs like this and pluck out a nice little line in there. I like wearing this though for Tamara's Never Seen, Tamara Just Saw episodes. It's a fun on-camera wig. I would never dare wear this in real life though. What's that term, butterface? This one's butter hairline. I bought this for a Leslie Nope cosplay. Channel Awesome got me a Leslie Nope essentials badge from the show and I'm obsessed with her and I really love this wig. It's a lace front, it was on Amazon and I'm pretty sure it was $24.99. And those are my blonde wigs. You, you're so sassy. I bought this for a Black Widow appearance that I was making on Nostalgia Critic and I've used it so many times since. I used it for Mara and I mean obviously it's just not correct for any of the characters that I'm using it for but she's really sassy, she's very bright and she gets the point across. Wigs with bangs are kind of hard, huh? This is Ariel's big sister, Rebecca. This fun circle of joy. Another 90 cent find at the thrift store. It's a Disney licensed Merida wig. I tried to untangle her in a wig untangling video and it, I, it didn't work out so I had to cut most of her off and then I turned her into a Chucky Finster, Chucky from Child's Play wig. I bought this on Wish, thinking that it was more all over red, bright red and then yellow and then orange. I used it in my grandma got run over by a reindeer Tamara's never seen. I used this when I cosplayed hipster millennial activist Poison Ivy. If I were to show up in a restaurant, you'd be like, she's gonna talk. She's gonna need to talk to the man. I've used this in some Tamara's Never Seen, Tamara Just Saw episodes. When did I buy this? Oh! I've never taken this out of the pack. <laughs> I was like, what? What character? I remember now. This is Kyrie from Kingdom Hearts 3. I kind of want this to be my real hair, you know? It's not amazing quality. This was on Amazon, and it was, I think, $18. I keep throwing out random numbers. I'm like, this was $24.99. This wig was $12. 47. This baby is my new best friend. It's for a new video series that Ayana, Heather, and I are doing. I was able to secure a wig sponsor for it from Coswigs. Love! 
Okay, those are all my red hair wigs. This is a lace front wig that I got off of Wish. And it's one of the more expensive ones. It was like $25, $26 plus like $10 shipping. I've used this in a lot of Tamers Never Seen episodes. This is that girl who was a horse girl growing up all throughout her life, horse girl, and then grew into her curls. And now it's just kind of slightly weird, but in an endearing way. You believe in life after love. I actually don't love this wig, but I've used it so much. I love this wig. And I would wear this in public, actually. I'm reminding myself of one of the America's Next Top Model girls, but just chubby. <laughs> I've also worn this a bazillion times for Tamara's Never Seen, Tamara Just Saw. I've gotten two wigs from this company, everydaywigs.com. They've been incredible. They were sponsorship deals. If I make a video about it, they send me a wig, bada bada bada. I wore it in a Tamara's Never Seen and I took it off at the end and everyone was like, shooketh. They had no idea. So this is a great, great wig. Everydaywigs.com honestly have, has amazing wigs and I would totally recommend them. This isn't sponsored. I'm just saying, it's a great company. This was another thrift store find. It was half off of $1.98, so it was a dollar. I wore this in a Tamara's Never Seen episode, and honestly, if I get one episode out of these 90 cent wigs, then they're totally worth it. And the dogs came up, and he was gone with the draft. He's in the eye now, below and reveling. He's the bit of a big boy of company B. I know the words. This wig has seen a lot of different cosplays. I've been Wonder Woman, Lara Croft, Ayana has used this as Wonder Woman, and that cooking weird lady on. Netflix. I bought this at a convention and it was $30. They were normally asking $45. And I was like, oh, I like that one. She's like, oh, it's kind of the top's a little messed up and mad, so I'll give it to you for $30. Bucks. I ruined it trying to make a general Organa cosplay hair look. And then I was able to detangle it super easy. And I love it. I love this wig. I love this wig. That wig was ruined for a while, like I said. And I ended up buying a replacement at another convention. This one was $40, and it's not nearly as good as that one, and I wish I wouldn't have done that. I had no idea how to detangle wigs at the time, and just thought it was gone forever. The bangs are really weird, and the top here is really, really weirdly matted. Why is it so matted? I've never worn this for anything. This wig has also seen a lot of cosplay, mostly as Velma, but I also used her in my Clue Tamara's never seen. It's Madeline Kahn's character, Mrs. White. I really love this wig. Hi guys, my name is Zelma, and I'd like to solve a mystery today. Thank you fucking very much. Okay, all we have left are wacky colors, and then extensions, bangs, and the like. This is Frankenstein's sister-in-law, Claire. Hi, my name is Apple, and I like going to Coachella, and Zoella, and under my umbrella. This is the second wig that I got from everydaywigs.com. It was another sponsor thing, and I got it for when I was playing a great fairy at C2E2. I love this wig. It's thick and really cool and ashy, and it's awesome. Lace front, this wig rules. I'm Mija, the great fairy. And I need 10,000 of your rupees, boy. This I bought because it was on sale at a convention for $10 and I had like two wigs at the time. I'm never gonna wear this for anything. What could I possibly use this for? It's pretty, it's thick. This may be the most useless out of all my wigs. I've never worn this. This and the white fro are the two wigs that I've not worn for anything. I've worn, I think, every single other wig that I have for at least a Tamara's Never Seen, Tamara Just Saw episode. This is still in power bun mode from my Green Mile Tamara's Never Seen episode. They are power buns no more. It's pretty cute, honestly. I wore it in a video on here that got a lot of attention because I was showing cleavage in it, which don't tell the police. I don't know what I'm gonna use it for, but it's awesome. It's very Sea Witch. Hi guys, Sea Witch here. See which? Oh, you want my actual name? It's Michelle! This is another one of the three sponsorship wigs from Cost Wigs. This is the one that Heather is gonna be wearing. Oh, look at this thing! My name's Heather Roos. And I'm a badass. This is the last wig from Cost Wigs. I said we got three of them. And this is the one that I am going to be wearing. I mean, this is like the updated of Sea Witch Michelle. Those were all of my wacky color wigs. These have clips on them, and I was gonna use this for the girlfriend in Deadpool, because she has some blonde tips, 
and uh, it didn't come in time. I got it off of Amazon for like $4. I have a lot of these kind of long clip-in extensions. Ugh, just a lot. They're falling on the ground. I used to use these in high school, and then I found some at the thrift store, and then I found some on Wish, and so I have three sets of them, and I really like them, and I actually do use them. I use them mostly for Princess Leia buns. This is my hair scrunchie that I got off of Wish, and this is my hair elastic that I also got off of Wish. Hi, how are ya? This is my bag of bangs. If you're interested in seeing those, I have a Wish fake bang haul, and it's one of my favorite videos that I've ever made, actually. <laughs> These are those halo bands. It has like a little clear band and then you put it on and then it just floofs out underneath your hair. I got these at the dollar store. Two blue and two purple. Four dollars. And I've used the crap out of them. I got this at a convention as well. It's a clip. Wow. Hi. These are a bunch of different color single strand extensions with clips at the top. Oh, I forgot about you. This is another wig. Not the best, but it works. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching and for allowing me to just um, organize my wig closet today. I have a lot of fucking wigs. There's more on my Amazon wish list. So, you know. <laughs> Thanks for watching. See you guys soon. Bye. Azeroth Netrion Zinthos.